by Defferman seven minutes ago a Maryland basketball player is unhappy with fans, a former TERP and a future one make buzzer beaters and Gary Williams must be sabotaging Debbie Yao again. Here's the latest from Terps Twitter. So the Terps just have to beat a team that's tired from the play-in game, then a team with a suspended coach. Then, they get home crowd in D.C. to lift them over Michigan State and then Duke, Final Four baby. In actuality the Terps will very clearly lose to Belmont 72-59, David Mallets, at Mallets, March 17, 2019 Final Four odds, East, 1, Duke 53%, 2, Michigan Street, 22%, 4, VA, Tech 9%, 6, Maryland 4%, 3, LSU 4%, 5, Miss. 3%, 7, Louisville 3%, HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash 3 kip tiled, Nate Silver, Adna T Silver 538, March 18, 2019. They face the winner of a play-in game, a team without its head coach, and then get a chance to play in their own backyard if they win. I'd rather have the 6 seed in the East than the 4 seed in any other region, Matt present, at Matt underscore present, March 18, 2019 I like. Fran Dunphy is great but MD would be a solid favorite over either. Two wins would put MD at Capital One. Dreaming. Kevin Sheehan, at Kevin Sheehan C, March 17, 2019 Five Dimes actually has a lineup for the Maryland is a five and a half point favorite over Belmont, Temple. Aaron Oster, at the Oster, March 18, 2019 One thing that has been very obvious the last few days is how badly Anthony Cowan Jr., the only upperclassman in Maryland's rotation, wants to win a postseason game. Terps haven't done so since 2016, his senior year of high school, Emily Jambalvo, at Emilygium, March 18, 2019 Maryland's NCAA tournament at large bid means $25,000 bonus for coach Mark Turgeon, Steve Berkowitz, at by Berkowitz, March 17, 2019 Start the conversation, greater than 247 sports.